So our third and final race here from Newbury is the Chalo Novice Group 1 hurdle. Over two, two and a half miles, or two miles five, should I say. Number one is Council de Moore for David Ladd, Dapple, Gray for Pontypool Racing is two. Stop messing around for Leon van Rensburg is three. Balance Spinel for Ryan Costello is four. Dal Tawa Martino for Hems is five. Reap What You Sow for Joshua Sutherland is six. Sins of Your Angels for Joshua Sutherland is seven. And eight is Saltbearer for Leon van Rensburg. So just eight of them to challenge over this Group 1 novice event here at Newbury. Over an extended two and a half miles. And we're going to wait for him to settle down. And again, we've got reluctant leaders this time in Sins of the Angels. I really want to take it on. Taking a keen hold as most of the field are. And his arms pulled out of his sockets there, the jockey on Sins of the Angels. Come stop messing around and dapple grey. The first of the three that get to the hurdle. And all over it. And just followed through by Dal Tawa Martino. The grey widest of all and closest to us is Reap What You Sow. And we've got Davy Lads, Council de Moore, up against the fences, Sword Barrett, Blue Silks, Yellow Cap. And we'll skip over that and just balance Spinel. We're riding on board Dal Tawa Martino at the moment as they approach the third. And it gets over that well. There's a good jump. Now we're on Sword Bearer. Balance Spinel. Jockey cams here. And still on balance for now as we get to the fourth. Sees all the leaders and himself, and they're all over it. And up front is a bit of a change now as Dapple Grey leads us by a length and a half. So the chasing pack, we're all still uh, reluctant to go anywhere at the moment. The one that's had to move really wide now is Swordbearer to look for a bit of room. He's just in front of uh, last place balance spin out. Go past the winning post of a circuit to go. It is Dapple Grey that's going to lead us by about four. And stop messing around. Sins of the Angels. Dal Tawa Matino. Reap what you sow. Just behind those is Sword Bearer. Council de Moore is in there as well. Sorry. And then just about three lengths just off the pack now of Balance Spinel. But we're still being led by Dapple Grey, the Grey. Originally named there by the Clutterbuck Pontypool Racing Stables. And it is Dapple Grey from four lengths ahead of Sins of the Angels. And Council de Moore and stop messing around. Wider of all those is Daltawa Martino. Up against the fence behind that is Swordbearer. And the Grey Reap what you sow. And just nosing into the pitch now is Balance Spinel. As they go over the fifth, they'll have another six flights to take. And it's still Dapple Grey that leads us. Still with a mile and a quarter to go. He's uh, happily bowling along in front by about four from Stop Messing Around. He's taken second on his own now. Then Sins of the Angels and Council de Moore. Then the three tools are rear. Dawati, uh, Martino, Reap What You Sow and Sword Bearer. It is still Dapple Grey. Skips over the six. Just stepped over that towards the rear was Sword Bearer. Just a little bit of momentum. But Dapple Grey's lead now has uh, gone. And stop messing around. Pulls alongside as they take the seventh together. They're both over it. One that took that really bad was Dawatawa Martino as he picked on landed and shuffled right back towards the rear. But it is stop messing around. It just noses in front. It's going to swing left handed in it with a mile to go. And it's stop messing around from Dapple Grey. Four back to the Joshua Sutherland horses of Reap What You Sow and Sins of the Angels together. And then a further three back to Dawatawa Martino. Council de Moore and Balance Spinel. We've lost shot off. But it is stop messing around. Takes a length and a half advantage now. Still being pushed along. Dapple Grey uh, being ridden a little bit now just to keep in touch. A length and a half back to reap what you sow in Sins of the Angels. And a further two back to Saul Bearer. Counts of Damore. Dautawa Matino. And balance spin out. But it is stop messing around as they're going to swing left handed into the straight and line up for the judge. And over half a mile still to travel. It's stopped messing around from Dapple Grey. Sins of the Angels just moving out on, on side net out with a little bit of room from Reap What You Sow. And they look like they're going to throw down the challenge to stop messing around. And it is Sins of the Angels that takes it up just by a neck. Inside the final half, it's Sins of the Angels. Stop messing around. Dapple Grey, these three. Reap What You Sow got a lot to do, as has Council de Moore. But up front is Sins of the Angels now being challenged by Stop Messing Around as they both go over the ninth together. These two are neck and neck, so Stop Messing Around takes half a length the planters from Sins of the Angels running on well Dapple Grey and we, we, what you sow but they're not going to catch these two leaders it's stopped messing around by a length and a half now as we come down to the final 
but the fence has stopped messing around from Simsy Ranger, but stopped messing around, has stopped messing around, and he's just taken lengths and butt out of this race, and it's stopped messing around by about four to Sims of the Angels, running on while his reap watches know that Dapple Grey still there. We're inside the final half, and it's stopped messing around. We better not mess around as we come into it now. Sims of the Angels tries to track it back, but there's not enough time. The novice Chalry Chalo, ooh, Chalo novice hurdle group over there goes to reap. I'm sorry, stop messing around, bro. Leon Van Rensburg, my head's not with it today. From second, Sins of the Angels, third was Reap What You Soak, Dapple Greg for Graham Clutterbuck out for fourth. I'm not sure who the fifth was there, it was the Dal Tawa Natino for Hems. So that's your five, let's move on.